Hello YouTube, it is Bernie Time, and today we are playing away against Plymouth Argyle. So, uh, the minute we are back in second, we played on the Tuesday night, and I think there's only three or four different teams playing, which Shrewsbury was not one of them. So, we have moved up into second from a good 3-1 win. Which I think was actually the same score that we got in my match, which is kind of weird. And now he's looking for some support. Very good distance. Um, on the last couple of days of the transfer, there were no new signings made. I was kind of hoping there would be another strong defender, because um, we do. I think we do just need someone who we can rely on on that back line just to make sure that we can keep clean sheets because at the minute we, we can't do that very well we managed to get in good goals and we couldn't in, in the attack stance of things but um, I had to concentrate for that then there are times when we do just slip up and it cost us dearly <laughs> I mean, the amount of points that we've dropped from just slipping, slipping up here and there, just you know, losing track of the game for a minute or two, or a split second even, and it's cost us a goal. It would be interesting to see just how many points we've actually dropped from doing that. But yeah, there's Dak putting that one in. I think Dak actually put one in three in that real match. I think it was two for Graham and one for Dak. Felt kind of um, okay. oh, that's the word. Jeez, sorry. <laughs> Felt sorry for uh, Armstrong the other night because he was playing brilliantly uh, and he had many chances and took lots of shots and everything, but he wasn't quite able to get the goal. But I did feel like he did deserve one. Just because of how, the play that he was making and he was running into gaps and up against their defenders and shuffling the ball through them. It just did seem like he, he, did, he did deserve to get something out of that match. Yeah, Mulgrew didn't play in the Tuesday night match because of his injury, which they've um, released the results of the scans and stuff and said uh, that it's not as serious as it first thought and that he will be back actually a lot sooner than expected, which is always good because obviously he's the skipper. Um, Bennett was re replaced him as the skipper on Tuesday night, which I had no real issue with. I mean, Bennett's been a part of the club for a good few years now. Uh, he knows the team fairly well. So I could see why they chose him as a the runner up. That's a cross the field to try and switch the play. That's a brilliant piece of intercepting there at a crucial time in a crucial position. Also I did um, I like how we've got Bell and the Envy on the two wings in the defence. Because both of them know pretty well how to um, get the ball and then move it up into attack. They don't, they don't just get the ball and pass it straight on to a midfield or anything. They do actually try and move it up themselves. Which Bell is a pretty damn quick bugger. As soon as he gets the ball, he's off. Jesus. <laughs> that was from a fair little distance out. And there's Bennett. Well, their work has made this goal Top right corner. Well, and across the keeper as well. I thought he might have grabbed that one. Or at least knocked it out. Oh, nearly at him. Jamie Ness. There's some potential in this move. 
Sawyer. He can cross it now. No, <laughs> never mind. Come on, keep the clean sheet. That was lucky. That was actually not the greatest pass in the world. That's a wonderful tackle. To Bennett. Spotted well by the Couldn't quite get it to. Couldn't quite get the pass to go through to my players. But we were surrounded by the defenders. They got a good bunch of them back to stop their attack. But here they are on the attack. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Here's Taylor. Go on up the wing. I should really put Bell on. I don't actually is that him there? Looking to play their way through now. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Now this is an interesting attack. Oh thought that was a May have been a foul, and he did kind of shove me a little bit. There was no contact on the ball. In what for? I'm just even looking at where the incident happened. Supporting player alongside. Could get the ball into the box now. Gets his cross in. Nonsense defending from him. He's got his shot off now. You can see what he was trying to do, opening up his body to place it, but he's placed it wide, sadly. For okay, him. just before the second half, we've got a good 2 0 lead. So, I'm going to go into that. Into the change of rooms, and the manager should be happy. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. Here's Bennett. Fans are definitely not happy with the performance of their team. Yeah, we've dominated this first half. They've had one shot, we've had five. Kick off here for the start of the second half. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. Delivered into the box. Oh, the wasn't a bad cross. That wasn't, I think that pass may have been uh, deflected a little bit. Oh, what for? I hit the ball. He's going to struggle. Oh, there we go. Oh, come on. He must have been bloody close. Headed down to a teammate. Conway. Could be dangerous. Yes, go on. Oh, nearly. Still ours. Oh. He was moving into an open spot. Point blank, point blank in front of the keeper. Nah, that was a pretty damn good pass. Yeah, they, um, on the Rovers Facebook page, they put up a, a fact that's saying in the past 300 minutes of our football, we haven't conceded a corner or a yellow card. Which I mean, to not concede a corner in what's that? In just in the uh, in the four matches. Oh, that's pretty impressive, I think. Not a high risk maneuver, but slightly risky. Trying to keep the ball here and risk losing it in the defensive third. Real opening now. 
<laughs> Absolutely slammed that one. Come on. Run up. Have a do. Oh, jeez. Maybe not. <laughs> Flew. Rhea has not had to, to make a, uh, a save yet. He's having a fairly easy match. Pretty well maneuvered. Very good distance to the clearance. Samuel. The pass should have really been a little bit tougher than that. Couldn't quite get to him quick enough. That's good support play from his teammates. In quickly. Jamie Ness. Go on, it's yours. No, that was a, no it wasn't. <laughs> Jesus, commentators didn't have a clue. Oof. Oh, bugger. <laughs> Gave it to him. Jesus, that was close. Alright, yeah, let's make that change. Well, this is the time where the managers really earn their money. It's going to be an alteration to try and improve the team. Thinking about it, I should have actually put Armstrong on. Defender did well to get to it, but hasn't really finished the job. Shots on here. Good block. They're looking for a hero here, this team. Well, those yeah, I don't think they're going to get the goals they need now. Plenty of aerial balls are going to be coming their way in the next few moments. Oh, damn it. I ran into him. Pretty much gave him the ball. It's a weak cross, really. Not getting past the first defender. Here's Bennett. Go on, that's yours. Oh, I needed it to go a bit further in front of him. That was way too far out from the keeper. Great pass here. With the space to go oh, just. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Oh, that wasn't hard enough. I was supposed to go all the, all the way across to Bennett. Oh, it's not Bennett, Samuel. <laughs> he hasn't got Armstrong on the bench or anything. Let's get the bell on and Payne. Payne did seem like he was doing pretty well on Tuesday. Um, he attacked the ball pretty well. I won't say he stood out from everyone else too too much, but how do you? Oh, oh sorry, thank God for that. Well, that assistant there, he was certain. Flag went up straight away. 
it's going to be a double substitution. Again, I'm making silly passes. Crisp defending there. He's closed down well and stopped the cross coming in. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of Samuel and added time. No, that's too big. Jamie Ness. Well, 3 0 win. It's a good strong one. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, if you enjoyed the video then please hit the like button, comment down below and maybe just give me some feedback on the, the videos and maybe the sounds and all that sort of stuff, just to make sure they're all level and you can hear everything right. And last but not least, if you haven't subscribed then please subscribe, and I shall see you guys in the next video. So thanks for watching guys, and see you later.